In this video, we're going to demonstrate how to draw a diagonal line and center it on the vertical axis, then dimension it a certain distance above the horizontal axis. To get started, let's click on File, New. Now let's go to the Part Workbench, Part Design Workbench, that is, right here. Click here to go to the sketch mode. Select the XY plane. Click OK. Now get your line tool right here. Create line. And draw a diagonal line. Next, let's make the line 40 millimeters long. Click OK. Next, let's set the angle to 45 degrees. Of course, you could use any angle of your choice. Click OK. Next, let's make sure that Snap to Object is selected but Snap to Grid is not. Now let's come over here. Click on the Create Point tool. And let's put that point on the line at an arbitrary position. Right click. Now click the two endpoints on the line. And this arbitrary point that we put on the line and then use the Constrain Symmetrical tool to move that arbitrary point to the center of the line. Next, select the arbitrary point which is now located at the center of the line and click the intersection of the horizontal and vertical axis. And we're going to use the Constrain Horizontal Distance tool and we're going to set that to zero. And this will move the diagonal line such that the center is located on the vertical axis. Now we can, if we wish, click on this zero dimension here, this constraint, and delete it if we like. To set the vertical distance for this diagonal line, choose any point you like. For instance, we could choose this left endpoint. Choose the intersection of the horizontal and vertical axis. Click on this tool, the Constrain Vertical Distance tool, and set that distance to whatever you desire. In this example, we'll use five millimeters. Now you've located your diagonal line with the center on the vertical axis and at a defined height above the horizontal axis. Thanks for watching.